Here's a question. How much cleaner are battery electric cars compared to gasoline-powered cars? To find out, the Union of Concerned Scientists studied the total global warming emissions of each vehicle throughout every stage of its life, from manufacturing, to driving, to disposal. And there's a big difference. Both cars start out on the assembly line with similar parts made of raw materials like steel and aluminum. For a gasoline car, this manufacturing and assembling stage generates about seven tons of emissions. Battery electric cars, meanwhile, are powered by, you guessed it, a large battery. This requires more energy and materials to produce for an 84 mile range battery electric car, bringing its emissions tally up to roughly eight tons. But what happens when they hit the road? Gas-powered cars produce pollution with every gallon of gas they burn, with even more emissions coming from extracting, refining, and transporting the fuel to gas stations. Electric cars, on the other hand, run on electricity, which can be much cleaner than gasoline, depending on how the electricity is made. Two-thirds of Americans live in regions where charging an electric car produces fewer global warming emissions than driving even a 50 mile per gallon gasoline car. By the end of their lives, the average gas car will rack up 57 tons of global warming emissions, compared to 28 tons for a battery electric car. Disposing and recycling each car adds less than one ton of emissions. And remember that electric car battery? It can be recycled or reused. In the final tally, an 84-mile range battery electric car cuts global warming emissions by more than 50% compared with a similar sized gas-powered car, making up for the battery's manufacturing emissions within one year of driving. And as the country adds more and more renewable sources of electricity, driving electric will get even better. So there you have it, straight from the engineers at the Union of Concerned Scientists. Electric cars, clean and getting cleaner.